Have you ever wondered why the ancient philosophy of Stoicism still resonates strongly in our modern world? A question worth pondering, isn't it? Stoicism, a philosophy born in the bustling markets of ancient Greece, has found its way into the fast-paced, technology-driven world of the 21st century. But what makes it so relevant? Stoicism is not just a philosophy, it's a way of life. It's a system of personal ethics grounded in logic and an understanding of the natural world. It's about developing a fortress of self-control, a shield of fortitude, to stand against the destructive storm of emotions that can often cloud our judgment. It's about learning to navigate the tumultuous seas of life with a steady hand and a calm mind. In essence, Stoicism is about finding peace within oneself amidst the chaos of the outside world. So, let's dive into how to apply Stoic wisdom in five easy steps. The first step in applying Stoic wisdom is understanding what's in your control. Imagine life as a play, you can't change the script, but you can control how you perform your role. In the grand theatre of existence, fixate on your actions, reactions and attitudes rather than external circumstances. This Stoic principle encourages you to channel your energy into what you can change and to gracefully accept what you cannot. It's a passport to tranquility, a smoother journey through life. Remember, energy flows where attention goes. Our second step is to embrace the present moment. Stoicism illuminates the significance of living in the now, because truly, this is all we have. The past has passed, it is a ghost, a memory, the future, a mirage, an illusion of possibilities that may or may not come to fruition. These are beyond our control. What we do have control over is this very moment, the present. It serves as our launching pad, our point of action. The present moment is your greatest point of power. Step three of Stoic wisdom asks us to develop indifference to indifference. This might sound somewhat paradoxical, but it's all about understanding what really matters in life and what doesn't. The Stoics believed that most of the things we stress over are not essential to our happiness or well-being. They are, in essence, indifferent. How do we cultivate this indifference? It's all about recognizing that many things in life are fleeting, transient, and ultimately inconsequential. The opinions of others, material possessions, fame, these are all temporary and often out of our control. By acknowledging this, we can start to detach ourselves from these non-essentials freeing up mental energy to focus on what truly matters. This is not about becoming cold or unfeeling, but rather, it's about achieving clarity. It's about understanding that the pursuit of non-essentials often leads to dissatisfaction and stress. So the Stoic approach is to acknowledge these non-essentials for what they are, and then let them go. Focus on what truly matters, and let go of the rest. The fourth step involves a fascinating practice called negative visualization. You might be wondering, how can anything negative be beneficial? Well, let me introduce you to the intriguing paradox of Stoicism. Negative visualization is the deliberate act of imagining worst case scenarios. It's not about dwelling on the negative or inviting misfortune, but rather, it's about preparing ourselves for life's inevitable adversities. This practice helps us appreciate the things we often take for granted. Imagine for a moment, not having the comforts you have today, or losing someone dear to you. Such thoughts can be unsettling, but they also awaken a profound sense of gratitude for what we have, right here, right now. Moreover, by mentally rehearsing these scenarios, we build resilience. We prepare ourselves to face adversity, not with fear and anxiety, but with courage and equanimity. Negative visualization, paradoxically, leads to a positive, grateful mindset. Finally, the fifth step in applying Stoic wisdom is embracing adversity. Stoics perceive adversity not as a setback, but as a chance for growth and enlightenment. Life, in its essence, is laden with challenges, and it's our response to these trials that shapes our journey. Instead of shying away, we must confront these challenges head-on, using them as stepping stones to our better selves. Remember, it's not the challenge that defines us, but our reaction to it. Embrace adversity, for it shapes you. So, there you have it. Five steps to apply Stoic wisdom in your life. We've explored the necessity of understanding what's in our control, the importance of embracing the present moment, the power of developing indifference to indifference, the value of practicing negative visualization, and the courage in embracing adversity. Stoicism, a practical philosophy, 
is a tool that's accessible to all, and its application can truly enrich our daily lives. Remember, it's not events that disturb people, it's their judgments concerning them. Stay stoic, stay strong.